Hello everybody. I hope you've had a really lovely week and I do hope that you had lots of fun in your garden uh, because the weather was really nice last week and maybe you've seen things that are growing. Maybe you've planted some things. Maybe you've got some seeds that you planted and maybe you've started to see the shoots coming up. Lots of exciting things. So we're going to go into the garden today and we're going to sing about some fruit and some vegetables but we're going to start off singing about the little tiny seed so close your eyes and be ready to start growing <laughs> And I know that you do too. And I know all the teachers do as well. They always join in very, very much. They love all the rain falling and the sun shining. So I hope you do too. Now, what shall we do next? I know we're going to go into the farm and help the farmer plant lots and lots of seeds. So remember that when we're planting seeds, we call it sowing. Oats and beans and barley grow, oats and beans and barley grow. But not you nor I nor anyone knows how oats and beans and barley grow. Now first we've got to plant all the seeds. But what shall we plant? Shall we plant vegetables? Or shall we plant fruit? Shall we plant vegetables over here? And shall we plant fruit over here? Okay, so I want you to tell me a vegetable that starts with a P sound. What did you say? Peas. I thought you said peas. So we'll plant some peas. Now I need a fruit. So I'm going over this side now. I need a fruit that starts with an A ah sound. Hmm. <gasps> You're right, apples. Let's plant apples over here. And now I need to, I'm going to go to my vegetable part again. And I want a vegetable 
that starts off with K. <gasps> carrot, you are clever today. Put lots of carrot seeds in the ground. And then now I need, I'm going to go round to this side to my fruit garden. And I need a fruit that starts with gr. Grapes. What a good idea. So let's plant some grapes. We could maybe plant green grapes. Then we would have two lots of gras. Green and grapes. Very good. Oh, we've been so busy. First the farmer sows the seeds. Then he stands and takes his ease. He stamps his feet, he claps his hands, he turns around to view the land. Such a busy farmer and in the autumn time he's going to have so many things to grow. Uh, will have grown up, won't he? We'll have lots to pick. And when, do you remember, when, we, when he's picking the fruit and the vegetables, it's, we call it reaping. And then he has a harvest. That's when he's got it all together. It's called a harvest. Very good. I know you remember all those words because we did them a few weeks ago. Now, I'm going to ask you for five fruit and vegetables that start with one sound. And it's going to be a b. And I've written some down because I thought, Hmm, I don't want to forget one, so well, I don't want to get them in the wrong order. But I also thought it will be interesting to have different colours. So I need something that is yellow, but it starts with a B. I'm going to have yellow beans. I like yellow bean sauce. I don't know if you like that, but it's very nice. And then I need something that's green and it starts with a B. Broccoli starts with a B and it's green, isn't it? And then I would like something that's a creamy white colour that starts with a B. The skin is yellow on the outside. A banana. That starts with a B, doesn't it? And then what about something that's red? Now, actually, I don't like this, but lots of people do. Beetroot starts with a B. That's right. And then our last things, we'll have five, is going to be something that's blue. Round and dark blue. Blueberry starts with a B don't they? So we've got so many colours and so many different fruit and vegetables because we've got beans are vegetables, broccoli is a vegetable, banana is a fruit, beetroot is a vegetable and blueberry is a fruit. Do you like beans? Yes, I do. Do you like beans? Yes, I do in a stew how about you now so we've got to remember beans do you like broccoli yes i do do you like broccoli yes i do so i've got two things to remember now broccoli beans in a stew how about you now our third thing was bananas. I don't know about bananas in a stew, but that's how the song goes. I think it'll be a bit horrid, don't you? Anyway, do you like bananas? Yes, I do. Do you like bananas? Yes, I do. In a stew. How about you? Bananas, broccoli, beans. That's going to be a very funny stew. Now, our fourth thing, I'm going to swap it around because this is still my sore hand. So I'm going to just put 
four fingers up and keep my tuck my thumb in now so do you like beetroot yes i do do you like beetroot yes i do beetroot bananas broccoli beans in a stew how about you i don't think this stew sounds very nice to you it sounds like a witch's stew now our last thing was blueberries now we've got five things do you like blueberries yes i do do you like blueberries yes i do in a stew blueberries beetroot bananas broccoli beans i don't think i want to eat that stew do you want to eat that stew no okay let's not eat that stew now i am going to have some peas because we i did ask you before about a vegetable that starts with p and you said peas so we're going to do the story about five fat peas so have your five peas and they're going to start off very small five fat peas in a pea pod pressed one grew two grew so did all the rest they grew and 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 they did not stop until at last the pod went pop oh they're all gone now now you know if you've been planting lots of seeds it's really important to make sure that the birds don't eat them so what we need to have is we need to have a scarecrow to save all the seeds from being munched up by the birds so i want you to lie down on the floor now and we're going to do the scarecrow song but you'll have to listen because sometimes i'm going to ask you to be quiet and sometimes i'm going to ask you to be loud when all the cows were sleeping and the sun had gone to bed up jumped the scarecrow and this is what he said how can you do all the actions i'm a dingle dangle scarecrow with the flippy floppy hat i can shake my arms like this i can shake my feet like that lie down and this time we're going to be very quiet scarecrows when we get up the dogs are in the kennel and the doves are in the loft up jumped the scarecrow and whispered very soft i'm a dingle dangle scarecrow with the flippy floppy hat i can shake my arms like this i can shake my feet like that were you very quiet as well okay now when i ask you this time you need to be very loud the Oh, I forgot what. Oh, I know. The hens are all a roosting, and the moon's behind a cloud. Up jumps the scarecrow and shouted really loud. I'm a dingle dangle scarecrow with the flippy floppy hat. I can shake my arms like this. I can shake my feet like that. Oh, I hope you had lots and lots of fun doing that song. I do love that song. When my children were little, they used to absolutely love that song. All right, now I'm going to say goodbye. I'm going to send you lots and lots of love. Have a great week and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.